New at 6, a local mother wants answers after she says her daughter was attacked at school. She says a student pulled her daughter's hair from her scalp Thursday morning at Hollis Innovation Academy in Atlanta. Channel 2's Larry Sproul is there live, and Larry, the mother told you she didn't even find out what happened right away. And she tells me that's the most upsetting part. That's because her daughter had to walk around her school right here with those patches in her head. And now she's demanding answers. She wants to know how this happened and why this happened. My daughter was bullied and her hair was snatched out of her head severely. Kanithia Brown says these bald spots in her daughter's hair happened when another student attacked her daughter Thursday morning here at Hollis Innovation Academy in Atlanta. Arguments over a chair, a seat, or whatever it was about shouldn't have got this far. You can see where the hair was ripped out of her daughter's head during the fight. It happened Thursday around 9.30 a.m., but she says she didn't find out until later. They failed to contact me yesterday after hours around 3.57 p.m., which I thought was, you know, inconsiderate. I'm furious because you walk around the school like that all day after that and they allowed you to walk around school like that. She tells me she finally heard from the school Friday morning. They issued a formal apology to me and my daughter this morning, but that's not enough. Now Brown says she's forced to take action. I prefer to press charges. It's not enough because the way my daughter's hair looked, there's a possibility those damages may not be able to be repaired. I reached out to Atlanta Public Schools and they confirmed they are investigating a fight between two students. In a statement, they also said school administrators are also reviewing their practices and procedures for notifying parents when issues such as this occur. The safety, security, and well-being of students and employees will always be a top priority at Hollis Innovation Academy and in all Atlanta public schools. And we do have that full statement on our website, WSBTV.com. We are live in Northwest Atlanta tonight. Larry Sproul, Channel 2 Action News.